Hey guys, welcome to this video. Um, in this video, I'm going to show you how to create an advanced media player. Um, this is a continue of my previous uh, tutorial um, about how to add music to a project, but this time I'm going to uh, do this in Visual Basic 2008 Express Edition. If you want to know why I was so uh, inactive on my channel, you will have to scroll over the annotation and that will explain everything so now press ok I renamed it already so you resize it to whatever you want and change the text let's say uh... wait a second media player media player ok uh... whatever you want of course I like this uh, like that <coughs> so now um, I'm going to add a list box let's see where it is, uh, there it is and make it a little bit like that and now I'm going to add a button and I go to uh, dialogues and add a open file dialog so I go to the button and I change the text to add music now go back uh, to the tool toolbox and add a, a da data binding source or binding source I like to use this uh, I don't know why but okay so uh, I get to my list box and uh, click in this arrow uh, check use uh, data bound items and data source is this one binding source one oh click this one <coughs> okay now go to add music type in oh type in open file dialog one dot show dialog like that um now double click on the file dialog and you see file okay then I'm going to type in um bind source one dot add and then values object so then it will be uh, open file dialog one dot file name like that and close it now go back to the properties of that one and then click filter filter and music type in music files then it's horizontal line and then asterisk I actually can put it like that and then the extension so I use mp3 as extension <laughs> um, also we need the Windows Media Player of course so if it isn't there you go to uh, an item doesn't matter where uh, choose items make sure you are located in uh, com components and not in net framework components scroll all the way down and here you see a uh, Windows Media Player check that one and press OK then it, was sh then it should be in there um, so I uh, drag it in go to uh, the behavior if you are categorized and uh, check the visible on false and change the very long name to when player one like that <coughs> okay uh, double click on this one and uh, go to uh, click and then uh, win player one dot URL oh wait a second launch URL equals to list box one dot selected select I mean dot Oh, wait a second um let's see equals to um god damn it <laughs> lol list box one select no 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 selected item that it is and then you can do two string but I don't think it's uh a need so let's see if this works too yes it works fine so <coughs> uh, I go back click and add music file 
so let's navigate to my music um, let's choose this one and there is an error lol okay so then that URL maybe this will work so navigate yourself again and it works I don't know if you can hear it so maybe maybe now it must be common harder but um so this is a way to make your own music player uh, you can add more functions uh, maybe I'll uh, make that later on uh, in another tutorial if some of you like this tutorial um, more tutorials are coming soon and uh, uh, maybe uh, I'll add this to my blog. Uh, I'm sorry, but <laughs> my site is. Uh, I've got the worst thing that a, a site, uh, uh, one of the site has, uh, can think of, and that is I have no damn access to my own site. And that's pretty strange, I think, but okay. It doesn't matter, I can use the blog. Uh, so I'll add the blog in the um in the video description and yeah uh you can find there one beginner's uh example of hello world and i'm making it busy with making my blog and it's pretty hard to do but okay so i uh, hope you like this tutorial feel free to comment rate and subscribe um so please subscribe then it will give me more um yeah more sense to make tutorials and I got mo more motivated when I have more subscribers to make tutorials so uh, also if you have a question you can visit uh, uh, my blog or just PM me on YouTube so I'll leave a comment of course so uh, thanks for watching again and uh, I hope I'll catch you in the next tutorial